My name is Larry Lacey. I work for the USDA up in Wapato, Washington. I'm an insect pathologist. I work between tree fruit and potatoes on a variety of pathogens. In the case of potato psyllid, uh, we've done laboratory and field evaluations of commercially available uh, fungi, which will be um, ultimately used on larger scale application. Uh, we've done the laboratory work and field work and concluded that we can get up to 78% control uh, using Isaria fumoserosia and um, Metarhizium anisoplay. And these are both commercially produced and uh, will be available to growers. There are several factors that can influence the activity of these uh, fungi. And uh, the most important is temperature and humidity. And these conditions are just perfect in the lower Rio Grande Valley during February, March, and early parts of April. The best temperature is between 20 and 30 degrees centigrade. And uh, humidity has to be close to saturation. However, this doesn't have to be all day long. If these two conditions are met within an eight hour period, we get good germination and infection of the, of the nymphs. Um, the upshot of our research is that at label rate and 2x label rate, there's virtually no difference. Um, it's one kilogram per hectare of uh, one product and one liter per hectare of another. Um, we're confident that in the future we'll be looking at application for adults and uh, this will stop spread into uh, further into potato fields. And for um, other future research we're looking at uh, application by novel means such as uh, auto dissemination.